So probably one of the most common questions that I get is, Jeff, like what is the best advice you ever received? You know, I get the, what's the best money advice? Like what's your best investing advice? But another common question that I want to answer is, what is the best advice? Like all the advice I've received over the years, what is the best advice I'd ever received? And I want to share what the answer to that question is right now. All right, you may have remembered in a previous video how I shot a vlog. I went to New York City in that vlog. I talked about working with a brand, but couldn't share who that brand was. Well, I can share now because the brand I was working with, that project I was working on has been released. I was working with Synchrony Bank and part of this campaign that I was working with them on, they wanted me to share with their community, with their audience, what was the best advice that I had received. And I mean, you talk about a fun project. I mean, I got to work with them, got to New York City, got to walk around New York City and, and check that out. In addition to that though, like sharing the best advice that has truly impacted my life. Like I can't think of a more fun project campaign to work on. So Synchrony, they put this campaign out there. And part of that was this video that I recorded in New York City that shares that advice. So without further ado, here's the best advice I've ever received. Take one marker. By far the best piece of advice I ever got was to study finance. I didn't know anything about managing money. I didn't know anything about saving, investing, budgeting. But by studying finance and just learning those basic money skills that I would need for my personal life, for my career, for my family, man, if I didn't have that, I wouldn't be where I am today. My name is Jeff Rose. I'm a certified financial planner. So my dad always wanted me to go to college and because he was a college dropout. Turns out I followed in his footsteps and I dropped out of college. My mom got me a job doing data entry at her corporation and I was doing that eight hours a day hating life. Uh, all my friends were going to college doing amazing things and here I was stuck in a cubicle. That's when I realized that I need to do something different, need to change my life, so I joined the Army National Guard. Joining the Guard was something that helped me just realize there's something bigger, better for me. So joining the Army was good because it got me to go to college to get my degree. What it didn't help me with was my finances. Turns out that I was taking on debt when I didn't need to because the military was paying for my school. So next thing I know, I am $30,000 of debt. I haven't even graduated yet. And now I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna dig myself out when I even started my first job. So my dad struggled managing money, struggled with debt for all of his life. But the one thing that he did tell me, the best advice he gave me was to study finance. And by doing that, all the bad financial habits that he had passed down to me, I started understanding those are bad financial habits and I started turning them into good financial habits. And I started, started to learn how to manage money and to budget and to save and to invest. I always tell people not to be complacent with their finances. You have to know what's going on. I'm not asking you to spend hours upon hours deep dive you know, into every little thing, but just have a general understanding of what's going on with your money. I remember meeting with this couple, they came in, they were in their early 60s, and they wanted to retire. You know, They were just tired of working, they had hard jobs, working overtime. And they came in and had all their statements, all their documents, and when I looked at everything that they had, it was hard to tell them, but they couldn't retire. They just didn't have anything saved. And I remember clearly them saying to me, the two regrets they had was that they didn't start saving earlier and they didn't save enough. That became like my mission of making sure that my family, my friends, any of my eventual blog readers would, would not do that, that they would start saving earlier and start saving more and just not be in denial about their finances. It's truly how one small piece of advice can have an exponential impact on your future. For me, it was majoring in finance, going to college and figuring out what that degree was going to be, like what that area of study. And I, I can't even imagine where my life would be if I would have majored in anything else. So big shout out to my dad for leading me and guiding me towards being a finance major. I mean, that literally changed my life. So that's the best advice I've ever received. What about you? What's the best advice you ever received that has impacted your life? More ways than you can count. Share in the comments below. I wanna find out what the best advice you've ever received and if anybody else can benefit from that advice because I know people love good advice and we all need it. All right, y'all, hope you enjoyed this video. Until next time, this is Jeff Rose reminding you that it's your money, it's your life, and only you can make it awesome. Until next time, peace.